Today we're going to take a look at the Stirling engine. This is a miniature Stirling engine and it operates on the principle of the difference in temperature between a hot reservoir and a cold reservoir. Let's give it a little more help here. Make sure it's in the, in the steady state, make sure it's really going. And we just added water ice, which is down to zero Celsius. So we put the top plate pretty close to zero Celsius. We saw that it was moving pretty rapidly. Now we want to do exactly the same thing with dry ice, which is 78 degrees below zero. So we're making that temperature gradient much, much wider. Now it's going to make some noise when I put the dry ice on top. Uh, usually it likes to slide around and make noise. It's just the way it goes. Dry ice is frozen carbon dioxide. So what's going on is as it as it sublimates, it turns directly into gas, and then it starts to slide around on the surface uh, wherever it is. Let me put some on this side. All right, we can see it moving much, much faster now. Let me, I think I missed one little spot. I need some ice right there. Let's let it finish doing its little jiggle. And so you can see it moving much, much, much more rapidly when we have a hot reservoir slightly below boiling and a cold reservoir 78 degrees below zero. Learn anything at mathandscience.com.